It's the reruns shown on Netflix that are bringing in the big bucks. Starring Rachel Green, Jennifer Aniston, Monica Geller, Courtney Cox, Phoebe Buffay, Lisa Kudrow, Chandler Bing, Matthew Perry, Joey Tribbiani, Matt LeBlanc, and Ross Geller, David Schwimmer. The show has produced some of the most loved characters in television. UCLA lecturer Tom Noonan, who was head of comedy at Fox's TV division when creators Marta Kaufman, Kevin S. Bright, and David Crane were pitching the show, told The Scotsman. You just don't know how is it when a group of people come together and, if you forgive the expression, make beautiful music together, is that going to be for a generation, or is it going to be for the ages comparing them to rock legends The Beatles, he said. I think with The Beatles we can safely say it's for the ages. It's possible with friends it's the same thing. It was based on a group of six twenty-somethings living in New York, with the on-off romance between Ross and Rachel being one of the main themes. NOW it seems, Friends is arguably more popular today than it was during its tenth and final season, with its six stars reportedly earning $A $29 million a year through reruns alone. Meanwhile, Die Hard fans who have been waiting for a Friends reunion better not hold their breath. Although, Aniston thought her castmates would be up for reprising their roles, telling Ellen DeGeneres that anything could happen. Cudrow, who played Phoebe Buffay, recently dismissed the idea, as said. The 55 year old star explained, They're rebooting everything. I don't know how that works with Friends, though. That was about people in their 20s, 20s. The show isn't about people in their 40s, 50s. And if we have the same problems, that's just sad. Dot and Schwimmer, 51, has similarly echoed that sentiment in the past that the cast are just too old to play the same characters. The actor who had the part of Ross Geller in the sitcom previously said, Look, the thing is, I just don't know if I want to see all of us with crutches and walkers. I doubt it, I really doubt it. But thank you for asking and moving on.